Peter Vesey loves the state of Texas, so we're going to San Antonio, AT&T Center, unfortunately for the Spurs. No Manu Ginobili, second full game miss due to sprain left index finger. Tim Duncan passed Andrea Bargnani there. Spurs up 10-4. Then the Raptors on the move. Juan Dixon, the Maryland man, finds Jason Capono, the former Heat man, for three. Capono, 15 points in the game. Toronto leads 19-16 at the end of one. In the second, Carlos Delfino with a nice look. Chris Humphreys, part of a 14-2 run for the visitors, and they're up 26-18. Now, Chris Bosch controls the loose ball, stopping and popping for two. But he was held to 10 points and nine rebounds in this game, having to square up against, you know, the big you fundamental. Know, you know, I, I love players who can hit from beyond the Desmond Mason, Juan Dixon line. Okay, don't get you. <laughs> told you not to use all their good stuff in the A, oh, and you sorry. didn't. Meanwhile, getting it back out, that's Anthony Parker. Third quarter numbers, 52-38 Toronto. Michael Finley to the wide open Duncan. First attempt, missed it. Second was good. Caps a 9-0 run for the home club, but still they're down by 5, 52-47. Emil Doka over to Jock Vaughn, finds Michael Finley easily. 20 points in the game for him. Toronto's up 59-56 at the end of three. Fourth quarter when it really matters. Juan Dixon to Chris Humphreys. Baseline, throw it down with noise. Toronto's up 65-56. I smell an upset at the AT&T Center. Jose called Rome. Off the Humphrey screen on Parker, lays it in, and uh, Calderon, 14 points in the game, gets it to Humphreys there. Humphreys, 14 points, Peter, 11 rebound. Toronto takes it, snapping a three-game losing streak, winning by 10 deep in the heart of Texas. First Spurs Eastern Conference loss.